Hello, I'm Katie from Midnight Music and welcome to the second video in a five-part series of Audacity Tips for Music Teachers. In this video we'll look at how you can shorten a song by chopping off the end or the beginning. We'll also learn how to add a fade in or fade out to make the track sound more professional. First of all, import your audio track into Audacity. Next decide where you'd like to shorten the track. I'm going to keep just the first 50 seconds or so so I'll find that place in the timeline at the top of the screen. I like to listen to the track at that point so that I can check that I'm cutting off the song in the right place. I'm going to fade the song out a few bars into this chorus. To chop the end of the song off, I'll click on the blue waveform around the one minute mark and then select everything from the playback cursor to the end of the track. There are a couple of ways you can do that. Firstly, you can click and drag your mouse over the blue waveform to select it all. Or you can ask Audacity to make the selection for you. This option is really useful if you want to select the track from a specific point. To do that, first place your playback cursor where you want to make the chop and then go to Edit, Select, cursor to end. Once you have the section selected, simply press delete to get rid of it. With the end part removed, the song now ends really suddenly. So to make it sound more professional, we'll add a fade out. Click and drag your mouse over a small part of the waveform at the end of the track. Then go to the effect menu and choose fade out. You should see the end of the waveform change shape and then you can listen to the fade out to check that it's okay. If you don't like the result, you can press Ctrl Z or Command Z on Mac to undo the fade out and then you can do it again. Remember that the bigger your selection, the more gradual the fade out will be. The smaller the selection, the more sudden the fade out will be. You can do the same thing at the beginning of the track. Remove the start of the song and then you can apply a fade in so that the song doesn't start too suddenly. These tips are from the Amazing Audacity online course for music teachers. For more information, visit midnightmusic.com.au forward slash audacity online.